Hey guys again, this video is gonna be called uh, the fear of the dark zone or dark zone fear uh, Actually, I'll be discussing something very important that I noticed uh, You guys always uh, hear about the rogs and all the players that kill other players for loot and all of this, right? So I find it have a very um, bad effect on everybody and I'm gonna explain that uh, right now in this video so let me just explain what's going on uh, I actually was passing by the dark zone I was too scared to, to play dark zone since the beginning of the division because of all the talks about the rocks and how you're gonna lose your weapons and all of this uh, uh, talk about it's damn hard and everything so I'm, I'm always frightened to play it right so I'm just passing by the dark zone and I decided to just go there and just drop a checkpoint and go back right so once I go I went in I killed the guy and he brought me this um, uh, like a green weapon a victor so I liked it so I thought ah oh, what the hell someone killed me so I, I lost it right away so I'm like no way I'm losing this I, I fought for it so so well so I'm not losing it so I went in I, I killed a guy then he killed me I killed another guy he killed me I killed another guy and they killed me until they were all uh, no guys I mean I finished them all so I, then I went and I got my my victor right then I, I found out that you cannot go out with uh, with the weapon because it's contaminated you cannot go out of the dark zone unless you're gonna lose the weapon so I'm, I'm like oh no way I'm not losing all of this time of heavy fight just because the weapon is contaminated right so I decided to um, to go in again and clean it right so I went into the left side which was very hard Everybody's 14, I'm still 8, and of course in the dark zone I'm like 2 or 3, level 3 or something. So then um, I went to the right side and that's uh, where I found these guys in front of you in the video. Uh, I fought well, it was a good fight, then uh, they killed me and I lost uh, my, um, my loots again, plus whatever was increased, right? Then... Um, then I went back on and on until uh, I managed to um, to clean some of the weapons but then now <laughs> I have this two loots to get yeah so then comes the very important point I want to discuss with you guys uh, I'll let you watch a little bit of uh, the fight then when it comes the right moment I want to uh, show you what's my point uh, on all of this video So um, I'll be back trying to kill the guys until I get my loot that I just lost, right? And it's a hell of a fight. It was a good fight, right? Everybody's like uh, very hard and they're all purple and, and they're not easy to kill. So I killed like one or two and then I died. Then I killed one or two and then I die and, and so on, right? You see, so I'm trying to get my loot so bad. Um, yeah, I succeeded in getting my loot. And I thought, what the hell, I'm just gonna escape. And then I found out that you, you cannot go out with them. Then I uh, I thought, it's only one guy left. I'm just gonna kill him and clean them. Th then I can get the hell out of the dark zone until I'm ready for it again, right? Or maybe I can come back in groups. So... I killed the guy after a good fight. There were like three of them, I think. Alright, so you guys can watch the fight. So fighting in the dark zone, you have to be really clever, like um, if you're going alone, I mean. Uh, you have to always keep uh, your medic um, like close or use this um, 
I don't remember how it's called, like this uh, box that I just placed there, the bag, and it give me immediate medic. Plus, you have to always use your um, your torrent and bombs. Don't don't be clear, uh, like wide open all the time. Uh, use your headshots a lot. You need to really work it out. So you can get it's like really hard uh, fights, but it's very very fun. So, let me get to my point now before it happens. So, everyone is so scared from rogs. Everyone is like, uh, someone is going to kill me. Plus, of course, losing trust in, in humans because they're humans, they're not computers. So, you don't know what's in his intention when he's coming towards you. And a lot of people, they trick everybody and, and there's so much videos out there on YouTube and everywhere. Uh, about uh, someone is telling someone to do something and when he do it he kill him or like betray him or whatever so all of this kind of videos and all of this kind of morals and and things that we hear it's affecting our play now that's what that's what this video is all about because it happened with me right here it's just it maybe one more minute I'll, I'll show you what happened it was really interesting that's when I decided to do this video it's just killing the game for everybody at least for a lot of people not for everybody but it's killing the game I mean you cannot trust anybody you cannot behave good meanwhile you don't understand what's going on like uh, is this guy's gonna kill me if he's not is is he good intention and then the rocks there so right now the area is clear so I went I gave the the mark for the plane to come the, the shopper come and take the weapons to clean them right then this guy showed up and I, I'm fighting the guy and here we go a guy called Mickey Mouse I have no idea what happened here he came and then I panicked because he just came from my back and I was bleeding a lot so I thought it's him is he an enemy I jumped then I realized he's not an enemy, he's, he's, a, he's a human. So I trusted him and I gave him my back here. Then I found myself bleeding again. So I put my uh, medic. I'm looking who's shooting at me. Is it the computer? And, and bam, it's him, right? He's shooting at me. But then... Then let's, let's rewind this. Like, I'm gonna play it again, right? Here we go. So I called the plane. Here, I called the plane and then he comes is he shooting at me or is he fighting with me until now I cannot decide right then if he want to kill me he could have killed me by now right I am wide open and this guy running towards him he killed him then that's his torrent and then I'm bleeding right he's shooting at me so did he think I'm gonna kill him so he's shooting at me or what happened I have no clue so I'm looking who's shooting at me, I still cannot believe it's him, right? Then I find it's him. So, this is what I'm talking about. Maybe he was scared for me, and I was scared from him, that's why it was... So the point of the video is, don't be scared. I mean, if a rock is there, just respawn and come take your revenge or whatever. But just enjoy the game, play it. Play it like there is no fear then this when I came back and I found my loot is there so this kind of confused me more so so this guy is not evil he didn't try to kill me he was scared for me because if he was trying to kill me he would kill me for my loot why did he leave my loot right then that's when I decided I'm not killing this guy his name is Mickey Mouse <laughs> And he was dead. He was like uh, almost dead there, if you can see. And I had a white shot, so I could I could just kill him here, right? But I decided I'm not gonna kill him because he didn't take my loot, so he didn't mean any harm. Then when I find him coming towards me, still he had a, a shot here. I was jumping all over. He can just shoot me, but he didn't. So what I think is, he was a good guy. I was a good guy. But then we were all corrupted by this idea of the rogue. 
uh, people that's uh, taking advantage, betrayal, uh, no trust of human being and all of this crap that's going around. And that's what ruined our moment, right? So that's what my video is all about. Then I was just, <laughs> I couldn't believe it until now, so I just want to take a closer look I just wanna see if he's gonna shoot me then I'm like you know what let him be let him be safe and I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna come back yeah so that was my point of the video don't be scared guys it's ruining the game for us